Hello, welcome back to Linux Wednesdays where we look at Linux tips and tricks on a Wednesday. In this week's video, I'm going to show you how to set up the preferred applications for use in Linux. Maybe you've got a video file on MP3 or JPEG and you want to change the default application that they open up with. So if I go into this folder here called Files, you'll see here I've got an MP4, MP3, a JPEG and another JPEG. If I double click this JPEG, open up, press on Help and then go about and you'll see it says I'm using XViewer as a default program. Now I can right click and go open with and I'll say pick image edit a viewer. It opens up in that in that program. But if I right click and choose properties, I can then go open with and here I can do the default program. So the default program is image viewer. I can select pick viewer and press close. When I double click now opens up with pick viewer. If I right click it again, choose on properties and press on open with, I can then go reset. And it resets back to the default image viewer. There we go, X viewer. Yes I am a massive Sega Master System fan. But if I go to the menu button and type in pref and I can go to preferred applications and here you can change what web browser is default? So my default web browser is Firefox. And you've got Opera. Default mail reader. You've got KML service Thunderbird. And here we go. Multimedia. Default image viewer is image image viewer. Multimedia. So for example, the MP3, I can now open that up in VLC. My video I can open that one up in VLC. Default text editor. Default terminal. Uh, document viewer. And the accessibilities default web, pro, um, web processor and default spreadsheet editor. So if I close it, I can double click on the MP3. And if I go help, about you see it's now in the VLC player. If I right click it, press on properties and go open with, you'll see now it says VLC player. But if I stick it back onto your media player. And press close. It's now opened up with the media player, but back in the preferred applications, it will still say that I'm using VLC player. So I can go multimedia and then go media player. And it'll be the same thing for the MPEG 4. So using preferred applications, just a way to make it a bit more permanent so you don't have to right click all the time or go for each individual file. If you found this video of some use, Give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, the other button seems to work too. As always, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.